Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Stellaris. The uh, Terrapins have heard the uh, complaints from the Human Star Republic, and we have renamed ourselves once again. We're now the Hierarchy of Heroes. And our new complaint is that we weren't allowed to pretend to be caught off guard and interrupted by people showing up <laughs> to watch the video. <laughs> That's our new complaint. It lined up something hilarious about servitude robots having sex with half zerfuls, but no... <laughs> We're just going to have to acknowledge that we knew that you were here when we started recording. Look, you need to accept the the sex bots, you know? Just got to accept them. Yeah, I, gave, I just granted them citizenship rights <laughs> off screen. Hierarchy of heroes. So we've, we've banded together as heroes to defeat the Balrog. Well, we're all heroes on the half shell. We all have turtle power. Yeah. All right. So I was going possible? to... So I was going to uh, actually, at long last, get these ascension perks selected just to get the get the message to go away. So off screen, shit chatting away. I'm going for shared destiny as we no, not shared destiny. Crap. Uh, executive. No. Wait. Where did it go? I don't know where I am. I don't know where. What's going on? Galactic contender. Fallen empires cling to the ruins of their decrepit civilizations. Ever fearful of the younger and more dynamic races that surround them. Their time has long since passed. Yes. And then galactic wonders. Mega structures. Rightfully regarded as the wonders of our time. I want to see if I can build the uh, Gutenberg Bible here. And then leaves one slot left. Meanwhile, I anxiously await the completion of my planet cracker, which will be used for entirely peaceful purposes in attacking Zerfall. Hey, you got pirate surf. I do. The you are correct. Brigade. I'm moving into Arakanan's Maw so that I can collect the uh, dark matter that's there and work on this ruined science nexus. It's only going to take 4,725 days to complete. It'll be a little while. Yeah, I gotta keep an eye out. These these uh, space pirates could come into one of my systems. I don't know what my defenses are like here. I also noticed oh, last time, I think it may have been after our last recording session, that uh, I have some uh, pre-sapiens. I can uplift them. I think I'm gonna do that. I have some ape fibians. They're, they're giant roaches. Oh no, the Shazarok interface have closed their borders to me. How dreadful. Oh man, I just... Oh, I didn't even see if that was a commercial packed invitation. Or I was being informed about one or... If, who died and... Oh, the Admiral died. Okay, no wonder I can't figure out... I guess I should buy a new Admiral. <laughs> Because that's what's happening. Yes, yes buy him off of the uh, market. Shazerac interface has closed their borders to me, too. Where are you guys at? Because you just attracted my attention. We were at war with them. Yeah, okay. Well, you guys were. <laughs> I was at war with uh, the Besedon Star Authority. I don't really know who who was backing them up quietly and getting stomped on. Oh, no, we were at war with them before the... Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. They had the, the bullheads. They're like... They're the that Spider-Man villain. And they're they're missing their their fish. Ooh, got a whole bunch of stuff complete all at the same time. Yeah, I just had that happen too. That's what happens when we line them all up right behind, at the end of a yeah. session. <laughs> <laughs> it took them the longest to close their borders to me. Interesting. They were a little leery of doing it. Didn't want to push their luck, I guess. Rising unemployment on lag and chew. I have to sell this planet back to the lag and chew. <laughs> this place is more trouble than it's worth. There's a lot of boom. We built something over here. Yeah, the lag and chew plants, uh, it's got some issues. 
I wonder why. Negative 21 housing. I'm working on it, guys. Give me a minute. It took the Besedon Star Authority a long time to fuck things up this bad. It's going to take me a little while to fix it. Oh, because I took that from somebody. Ah, I see. It was one of the uh, Shazrock planets. Yeah, and it's got like a giant station that just has like nothing on it. Huh. Oh, you mean the Popwise? No, no, like the like the star space uh, star fortress they built a star fortress well i probably destroyed the star fortress the state of star fortress but it doesn't have any modules now ah okay either that or they're just really bad at building things i guess i could do migration with the lag and choose again since we're pretty sure they're not the ones who are selling humans into slavery now yeah and again they might, uh, they're already half my population well by half i mean eight percent the largest mm, single group edicts. 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 Uh, it was just the wartime edicts. They can go ahead and go ahead. Hmm, should I chase JG for the L gate? Hmm. I would rather you didn't. <laughs> I thought you would let me have that just so that I won't like take my ball and go home and complain to my mommy. <laughs> I was That's actually the only more, reason why. <laughs> I was actually more tempted to uh, just take it to liquefy it and get whatever you get out of it. I don't remember what you actually get out of it. It is election time. Contest I don't care about any of you. Regardless of what they are. So let me We've see. Got I think, a 159 I think my plan was to. 153 year old, 125 year old, and a 60 year old. <laughs> what were you saying? I'm sorry. Oh, I was thinking about it. I've already claimed the system where the O gate is. I'm wondering what else I should be doing because I think that it, that, that I'm going to recommend that's our next war to grab the O gate system. That's fine by me. The Sulaban are part of this game. The Sulaban Marauders. <laughs> Never even noticed them down there. Oh, they started upgrading. Dang it. And now their upgrades are complete. Well, no, I sent someone after the pirates and then I accidentally started upgrading them. Oh, the pirate. You're upgrading your pirates to buccaneer status? Now they'll be able to go over land. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's a different thing, JJ, you moron. I'm not watching your OP anymore. Good riddance. Sorry, I meant privateers. <laughs> Let's go get a... Wait, would you actually let me build this here? Is the game seriously going to let me, would this game seriously let me build a ring world in a black hole system? You build it just outside of the event horizon. So yeah, you... but imagine the lack of light. <laughs> well, I mean, technically there's a bunch of light that goes around the black hole and comes back. And if you're at the event horizon where you're going, you don't need eyes to see. <laughs> don't don't jump. <laughs> So I assume if you're going to the event horizon, you're going to a dimension of pure chaos and pure evil. I mean, of mm, course, might, might as well jump. Enforcers reduce crime by additional percent. Capital buildings and housing. Oh yeah, no, I need that housing. Give me the housing. Domination perks, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Dominate the galaxy with more people crammed into each unit of housing. That will actually have an immediate good effect. More research labs.
if I got any branch offices that I can upgrade. Nope. Let's see if Zerf has any good uh, planets for me to establish branch offices on. No. Stop him, Zerf. He's going to establish branch offices. I am going to siphon off your sweet, sweet energy credits. Wow, those planets that you took from the Shazrock are really bad right now. Oh, they're bad. <laughs> they're bad. Don't even look at them. They're bad, bad. Still, still working on that uh, Colossus. Why am I not surprised? Seems like it's a slow-moving thing. Hey, but I can start building Titans now. That's always a good thing. And I think I will. <laughs> I got an alert. Hostile station engaged before it even stopped talking. Pirate station raided. <laughs> that is always nice. Oh no, the Blood Brigade. Honor the charge they made. Honor the Blood Brigade. Noble dead pirates. I think we're now all... Uh, powerful enough that we're all presumably kind of corrupt and evil and that any pirates are like actually you know vaguely the heroes of like um you know um serenity or what was it called uh <laughs> any any pirates are actually like really noble uh, heroic guys who are living as outlaws and fighting against our corrupt uh, regimes <laughs> So we can build Federation Titans. Uh, I am going to uh, make one, at least design one, a better one. But we're a peaceful Federation, so this is a Titan that only exists for peace purposes, you know. Of course, of course. It's like Doctor Wily in Mega Man Three. We have a peacekeeping giant death robot. Yeah, you know. Uh, I mean, it can slightly blow up the planets. Yeah, I'm gradually... Yeah, I'm making the lag and choose planet less crap. Yay! That's pretty sweet. So now the question is, how many of these things can we actually build? I just bought an emergence of something pops just because I was maxed out on energy credits. So I was like, why not? Edicts plus 10%, uh, penal colonies, administrative capacity, naval capacity. I guess starbase capacity is probably the most viable of these. Our Federation can only support three Titan-sized ships. All right. Wow. We got a Titan. We got a Titan after Earth, a Titan before Earth, and then just a Titan Earth. And those are your three <laughs> Titans you get to build. Why is there so much unemployment here? What are they doing? Well, they're not working. Oh, I want to be a specialist. <laughs> I want to be paid for my research. I'm European. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I have 15 unemployed uh, menial worker, whatever it is. Workers, yes, workers. That is crazy. Uh, yeah, you can show me your wares. So who you are got. the Nagyari company with their little pill bug logo? Who are they friends with? Cause, uh, I think they're in a federation. With the lag and choose. So if nothing else, I can't send all of my fleet to hang around in jump range of their space. Somebody has to sit there on the lag and chew border if nothing else.
Well, I mean, you want lag and choose stuff. Do you have more uh, claims on any of them? On any other stuff? I don't think I bothered because I think uh, now that I got once I have a Colossus, I can just we can do Total War, right? That's true, and yeah, if you're just waiting for the Colossus to be finished. But I figured before I bother with the lag and choose, since you're you're starting to express interest in the L gate, I would maybe finally get the. I was joking. The L -gate, I was yeah. just joking. But Zerf is now and uh, he's now over there too. We got these scary, scary Zerftopia skulls everywhere. Listen, like, our empire is expanding, and if it expands over to an L gate from all the way over here, that's not my fault you didn't go over there. No, I hear you. I, that, I, that, I, that, I think that's pretty legitimate. You've got an aggressive prime minister over there in Zerftopia who's really making things happen. <laughs> prime minister. No, no, no. He's a monarch. An illuminated autocracy. Yes. It's funny because our... Uh, Royalty is actually the royalty of another empire, but we just accept them as our own royalty as well. <laughs> that that empire is really small and takes you know, there's only one like sort of island now on our home planet. I just have this notion that your empire has like two districts, one of which is 98 percent of the territory and is led by your prime minister and is doing all the work, and the home system is ruled by Zerfall himself. It's just kind of like hanging around, you know. <laughs> I am the can't, king. Can't, you sure are. Come here and cut this ribbon. The king. But man, does the populace get excited for a royal baby? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh man, titans take forever to build. I suppose I could have foreseen that. But really everything thought takes about forever it. to build. <laughs> If it's worthwhile, end game. I can't quite do the uh, do the arcology project on Chalanus. Hmm. Gotta work on that. What am I missing here? Rare crystals. I need six more of them. There are so many things to spend. Uh influence on on the other hand somehow I got up to 700 I don't remember being that high you know what <laughs> let's let's go do some mastery of nature oh wait what am I doing I don't want shipyards here I want to So if you have a um, star base that's in a system with a gateway, can other species use your gateways? Do you want to have some good defenses on that particular star base? No, um, okay. unless they're they're unless they have open borders with you, uh, okay. then they can use it. But in times of war, no one else can, uh, no enemies can use your gateways. So you really only now, need hang like if you, they you... take your system with a gateway, then they can use it. Okay. But it would be more of a place to put your trade hubs and your uh, hangar bays so you can grab resources and expand yeah. protection. Yeah, all right. I guess I'll put a resource silo here. Yeah, I got a few that I need to... I'm going with anchorages for a little bit on a lot of things. Oh, man, even with these paradise domes, they don't have enough room to live. How terrible. That's pretty bad, I guess. It's a pretty heavy score. <laughs> Where do I want to start building more titans? Which is too freaking disorganized. I don't even know where I've got my best shipyards anymore. That's, I know why, what... I, that's why I tend to build one. Yeah. Maybe two. Mine is up in Ginnem, which is right next to a uh, wormhole, so... 
Oh, I've got more dying guys. It's very sad. Or oh, that's nothing. It's a citadel. It has no uh, modules built in it. It's almost a citadel because I've just been upgrading it and not building anything there. Pirate sighted. Ah, damn it. Oh. Grolian Trium Invoice Modifier. Monthly Society Research minus 100%. Six months. Trium Food Container Deployment. What does this do? One time delivery to a single colony only. Trium Food Containers are guaranteed to last 80 years and no longer decreases pop food upkeep by 10%. Eh, not interested. I can only have two titans at a time. That'll go up as you get bigger. I'm going to buy another reliquary. Reliquary contains a gun of unknown origin with the apparent trigger assembly removed. Didn't I have that one already? Oh, we have already opened the maximum number of reliquaries that the caravaneers will allow us to purchase. No! Bastards and communication. But it is about time to end the episode. On that sad, sad note. Yeah, I got pirates and deodorizers, and I don't know how I can keep up with all this input at the same time. So I'm happy, <laughs> happy for a little break. Well, we'll see you all next time, everyone. Bye. Bye.